Marilyn Golightly is joining me now, and we are talking about Dr. Seuss's birthday. Mm -hmm. And That's you are right. in the spirit. Yes. Tell us what we're yes, going to be yes, doing. Yes. Oh, it's fun. I did this. Uh, I said I was going to say a hundred years ago. It really <laughs> was hundred years ago, but it was probably thirty wow. at, at the River Stage. And this year, I thought, oh, we need to do that at the Literacy Council and get the mothers to bring their kids and help the mothers to read with their kids the Dr. Seuss books. Because what kids don't love Dr. Seuss? They need to. What person doesn't like Dr. Yeah, Seuss? Yeah, I know. They're so catchy. You can, everyone yeah. can love them. And uh, so this year, my daughter that is, goes to Emanuel Episcopal Church and is the youth director there, she said, oh, we're doing a Dr. Seuss party. And I said, oh, I'm doing it with you. I'm doing it with you. <laughs> Make that and, two of us. <laughs> yes. And so they are doing it in the courtyard. And Emanuel Episcopal Church is three South Randolph, across the street from the county jail, I think, close to the jail, downtown. Okay. Uh, uh, we're doing it in the courtyard, Saturday, March the 2nd, from 2 this to Saturday. 4. This Saturday is his birthday. Woo yes. And it's wonderful that we have some uh, high school students that are going to be singing and playing instruments. We've got some ASU uh, honor students that are going to help with some of the activities. And, of course, having green eggs and ham and birthday cake. Oh, my goodness. And playing hop and pop and uh, one fish, two fish, we'll go fishing. There'll be lots right, of activities. Talk to you about what the activities are. Well, one is going fishing. There's one fish, two fish. You know that we'll do that. And they'll get a red fish or a blue fish. Yeah, right. <laughs> they'll get they'll get and get some cheese. Those little cute little cheese fish. You know oh, that the gold whatever goldfish. Yes. Yeah, and uh, but they can go fishing and they'll get prizes with that, with that activity, and uh, hopscotch. So we'll do hop and pop, and they get some popcorn. Oh my gosh! And that's I'm going to come do that one. Well, come on! I want you to really, and. Um, of course, face painting is always fun to yes, do. Yes, kids love that. And uh, we'll do anything and everything. And we could have 10 or we could have 100 kids. And, and reading? We're ready. Are they going to be uh, certainly are gonna be Dr. Uh, Seuss books? Yes, Dr. Seuss books. Have, oh, and Glenn Junior High School has been so wonderful to do a book drive for this event wow. for us. And, you know, it takes a village to do things. And so I'm really pleased that people in the community uh, volunteer to help. And the uh, college and the high school kids will be reading some of Dr. Seuss's books. They'll be everywhere, and then the kids can take home a book. And so uh, every kid that shows up gets to take home. Absolutely. Or we hope, at least we hope that many kids I show up that that becomes a problem. Uh, right, exactly. <laughs> but every child will get a book. If I, you know, if we, but we'll have them there. Yes. But if we don't, we'll, I'll get it to them. I don't. I can drive. <laughs> <laughs> She's got the books, everyone. But you do fun events like this all the time, and getting to include kids from all over the community and different kids at ASU and high schools and junior highs. What is Isn't it that like wonderful? to see it all come together? It's wonderful. It's fun. And we'll have this Sousa band, the singing, and oh, do the wow. Sousa band. So it'll all be fun. And I'm so glad. So it's Emmanuel Episcopal Church this Saturday from 2 to 4 uh, in the afternoon in the courtyard. Even if it's... If the weather's terrible, we'll do it in the parish hall. Okay, so it's going to go on no matter what. Yes, yes, it will go on. And is it, where can they go to find out more information? Well, they can call the Adult Literacy Council uh, at 657-0013. Uh, or they can call the church, I, I guess, as well. But, uh, and again, I've said this before, go lightly in the phone book. You're the only one, yeah. There's I'm the only one, you. and I'm not the only one that's in the phone book. You know, I've got a landline still. So uh, you can find us, and we'll be out in the courtyard area and it'll be wonderful and you're doing this with your daughter and yes. the church so how excited are you to do an event with your daughter it's good it's good i, I like that young energy <laughs> <laughs> and now you'll get to see a ton of young energy on saturday mm -hmm. yes all mm -hmm. those little kids mm -hmm. rain or shine cold or hot it's happening right and we'll celebrate Dr. Seuss's birthday. And it's he's got wonderful books. They're still fun to read. Yes. Still fun to read. They mm -hmm. are. And it brings back so many memories mm -hmm. from when we were younger. We, you need to come. I know. <laughs> All right. We're sending someone. <laughs> That's happening this Saturday, everyone, at Emmanuel Episcopal Church from 2 to 4. Everyone bring your kids and go celebrate Dr. Seuss's birthday. Stay tuned. I'll be back.